For the first time since mid-March, a downtown Orlando tradition returned today. The Farmer's Market at Lake Eola Park. And as News 6's Amanda Castro shows us, crowds welcomed the return along with safety changes in this era of social distancing. Vendors showing up early to Lake Eola Park, setting up their tents, cooking food, and putting on the finishing touches to their booths. It's a sight we haven't seen in months. We were just out for a walk with our dog and we uh, we, we glanced over and saw that it was it was here. Jim and Beth Hobart say they used to shop regularly at the Orlando Farmers Market, but it shut down back in March due to the COVID-19 pandemic, putting small businesses like Cindy Weatherington's Mountain Creek Candles in jeopardy. This is my livelihood is the markets. So if there's no markets, we don't sell anything. So that, that hurt really bad. But she says she did a happy dance after learning the market was reopening on Sunday. Although it looks a bit different. It's smaller with only a third of the vendors. Everyone must wear masks. We saw downtown ambassadors handing them out to people who didn't have one. And social distancing is required. We had to limit the number of people that could come into the booth. So just like one family at a time or two people. And other than that, they got to stay six feet out. Mayor Buddy Dyer says the city learned its lesson from Halloween, so alcohol isn't available. Weatherington says despite the changes, she's happy to be back. This has been my best market and I have a lot of repeat customers, so I let them all know on Facebook I'm back. The Hobart's adding this is a great and safe way to support small businesses. It just feels like things are getting a little bit more back to normal and exactly. just bringing people together at a safe distance, So, and they're doing it really well. In Orlando. Amanda Castro getting results. News 6.